Well, hello, Cabrini, and welcome to yet another episode of Bless Your Heart with Jen Rose Giacomo. I'm Jen Rose Giacomo, and on today's episode, I have a lovely Nick here today, who will be talking about his new job here at Cabrini and his experiences at graduate school and everything else. Let's get to talking, shall we? Nicholas, <laughs> what's been up? What's been going on in the life of you? Uh, not much. Uh, about <laughs> two months ago, actually a lot. I shouldn't say that. <laughs> um, I can't. Two months ago, I mm -hmm. uh, finished graduate school. Blessings. Yeah. What? Where did you go? I what did you to, do? I uh, went to American University in Washington, D.C. Holy hot awesome. heavens. Yeah. How was that? Awesome. D.C. is wow. great. So, did you learn anything from the Cabrizi that took you, you know, oh, to yeah. American? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, definitely. Definitely. Um, for the most, definitely my writing with journalism. Nice. Um, I think radio definitely helped me with, uh, you know, my public speaking, oh, uh, social media. Um, a lot of stuff I learned from Dr. Zurich and social media was um, was huge. And that's a lot, I really feel like I gained a lot more um, experience professionally because I, I did that for my work and you know what I mean? So all together, I think I brought a lot of the skills from Cabrini there and I kind of just honed them a little bit more. Well, bless your heart, Nicholas, look yeah. at you go. <laughs> And now you're back at Cabrini. Tell me about this. How the heck did you get back into yeah. here? Okay. So um, I finished up grad school like two two months ago. Started applying uh, for jobs, and I, I applied schools in. I wanted to do higher education first okay. off. So um, I applied to schools in D.C., uh, Philly, and um, home at home where yeah. I'm from, Allentown, Why Pennsylvania. Not? Is, is so. not easy, by the way. Let me just point that out to everyone. <laughs> it is. It's it's really really hard. Um, so. Determination was a huge factor, and um, you know, kind of, you know, feel like sometimes you're getting kicked at the curb, but kind of getting back up and, and kind of keeping that motivation going is like the most important thing. Uh, seniors, juniors, you guys are experiencing that very soon. So, yeah. Let me sweat now. Get, pumped, get ready. Um, I saw the job at Cabrini, applied to it, and uh, it kind of it fit me perfectly. I was like, this is a this is a great position. So I applied, came in for two interviews. And uh, now I'm a coordinator of alumni engagement and annual giving. And what does that job entail, Nick? That's okay. a whole lot of words put into one yeah, position. I know. <laughs> so it's, so, um, we work in fundraising. That's kind of what we're doing. Oh, but cool. That's but awesome. what we want to do is coordinate with alumni um, and making sure that they kind of stay in touch with the school. What's happening at Cabrini? Uh, what events are going on? We have a lot of events that we do specifically for um, alumni. Uh, we're doing a lot of different things. And also, in the end all, keeping those connections and then hoping that um, alumni down the road decide that they want to give back to the school that help them and gave them their education. Well, I can't thank you enough for being with here today. Thank you, Jen Whoa, Rose. I'm losing my marbles. Okay. Thank you for being here today. Thank you. You're too much. You're too much. Stop. <laughs> Stop. Bless your heart. Oh, Stop. <laughs> Bless your heart. <laughs> well, Cabrini, this has been an extraordinary opportunity that I got to interview the infamous Nick Goulden. <laughs> Bless your heart, Cabrini. Until next time, I am Jen Rose DiGiacomo.